Welcome to another video. In this video, I wanted to make it a little different. I wanted to show you the Airbnb that we're staying in. Um, it's pretty well appointed for a pretty good price. It's in San Antonio, or Dominican Republic. And here's the gate or the door here that starts the entrance here. We just go up these stairs here. And the door to the um, Airbnb. It's pretty well appointed. So it's pretty secure. You can see these lights on here. As you can see, there's this terrace in the front. Real artwork there. And notice there's a security camera right here and there's another one right here showing the front or just you know, making sure that the camera is capturing what's happening now there's a gate there's enough room here for two cars to park now, so it's very secure and there's this front terrace here living room. And actually there's a fan on top of that light. There's a lot of artwork in this particular Airbnb. Um, as you can see, that seems to be the theme of it. Even in the bedrooms. Uh, we've been here two days, and basically we're pretty comfortable here. One thing I will say: the living room, dining room area, there's no like air conditioning. Here. There is that fan that's on top of that light there, but this area probably can get more humid depending on the day. The first day we got here was a little bit more humid. Yesterday, the, re the weather was in this area, um, or the temperature in this area rather, um, it was a lot better. Um, we even had dinner um, at this dining room table right here um, yesterday. Also, a pretty well appointed kitchen here. Um, everything we needed, we have here. And I'll put the description or the link to this Airbnb um, in the comment section. Um, if you're interested, It has three bedrooms. That's the first one. My wife is still sleeping, so I won't show that one. But the other two bedrooms are pretty much a model for the one that um, we're in. Let's see here. And up here. We find ourselves staying, that's why the pillows are a bit discombobulated, just relaxing in this area right here. This little desk area. 
uh, more storage capacity and it's pretty well appointed with pillows and towels and cushions. Um, it's not lacking for anything to be perfectly honest. It's a pretty well appointed apartment. Um, there are three bedrooms and four bathrooms here. And this is just one or the common bathroom in this area. It's not attached to any particular bedroom because all the bedrooms have their own um, bathrooms. And, and again, we find ourselves probably spending more time in this area because basically, here, let me show you the um, bedrooms and I'll explain it. Basically, most of the bedrooms pretty much look like this. And there are three bedrooms. Um, there's an air conditioner. And again, art is featured in this apartment. So it's um, well appointed again in that area. Closet space. And one thing I like about this Airbnb that's not like the rest, sometimes you go to an Airbnb, you don't have towels, you don't have wash rags. In every room, they have several, in every room. So there's no way you're gonna run out of towels or anything like that, and I really like that. And again, the bathrooms, all the bathrooms are similar to this. And there's, again, three associated with the bedrooms. Pretty well appointed, well stocked. So here, let me go right here and just show you the oven. And we leave the doors open and we leave the air conditioners on and it keeps the common areas cool um, from the kitchen on back because we'll generally leave these doors open during the daytime. Again, very similar to the other bedroom. And here's the featured arch in this particular room. And again, just like I said, there are many towels, washcloths. Uh, you will not be like in maybe other Airbnbs or those things you just can't find. And here's the bathroom area. In this particular bedroom, And here's the bathroom. Like this. Yeah, I would highly recommend this Airbnb. Let me show you the terrace in the back. And it's beautiful out here. And this is about 6.20 a.m. in the morning. Again, it's perfectly secure. Uh, everything is locked. And one thing I love about this is that there is a water cooler, so we always have access to cold drinking water um, right here. And we bought like a 12 pack of water, but we've just been drinking water refilling the bottles. We haven't even used the 12 pack of water and the water quality is very good here. It's just a beautiful terraced area right here. So you could do the laundry. You could hang it here. And we have a few things hanging um, that we just washed. It has everything you need, really. Everything you need service room here. The iron. Do I notice there's an iron there? 
oh my goodness, this is the first time I've just discovered this. Um, there's even another toilet and bathroom back here. I did not know this um, because when he showed it to us, I didn't come this far in. So really, this has five bathrooms. And it's even a shower here. So this is really, really, really well provisioned um, for any stay here. There are two extra bathrooms, one in the hallway that I showed you, and then there's the one here. So thank you for the, just listening to uh, me rant about this uh, particular Airbnb that we're in. Um, again, it's a very good deal. If you want to know the price for three days and checking out the fourth day, um, it cost me $191, not bad for three days, um, to get a quality Airbnb um, like this one here. It's not bad. This would be a wonderful place just to relax. Um, and it's, again, it's a very good product. One additional aspect that I like to this Airbnb, um, if you are wanting to go to the Malacan, and you probably will, um, particularly if you never visit Santo Domingo. Um, it's not that far. Um, it's just like a straight shot, um, and then not too far to where they have all of the rides and the games and things that you would do on, on the Malacan. So it's very close um, in the Zona Colonial area. Um, and we went there last, last night, so check out that video if you haven't seen it. Um, so that, that's just one good thing also. It's very close to restaurants. It's very close to activities. Um, there is no way you'll feel secluded in this area in Santo Domingo. I am ending with a Dominican breakfast here. Let me move this small pocket um, charger. Now we have platano eggs. Um, salami, avocado, e um, jugo de limon, freshly prepared lemonade. Um, again, my wife cooked all the food. And I'm about to put the camera down. Thank you for watching, and I'm going to enjoy this food.